gotta be somewhere. <coughs> Let's just keep looking. Can't see a goddamn thing. <coughs> Neither can they. Stay cool. We'll get through this. <coughs> Motherfuckers. He's right there. Got a beat up! Over here. Lincoln! Drills bust through! Hot damn, Alice! What took you guys so long? Piece of shit drill kept overheating. You and Lincoln both still in one piece? Yeah, we good. Where's Danny? He's pushing everything off to the side so that we have room to catch the money. All right, well, once you squared away up here, we start dropping it down. We'll make it quick. Motherfuckers killed the lights. Just worry about the money. I'll deal with this. Trying to flush us out. Stay focused on what you're doing. What's he think he's doing? Lock this place down. Need to get behind something. This is a goddamn massacre. Down. Reloading. Got Damn it, those guards will cut us down the second we make a break for it. Tell Danny he needs to get us out of here. And hey, these bastards got us pinned down. Y'all need to figure something out. I got some TNT. I'll put on our side of the hole and detonate it. What the fuck is that gonna accomplish? With any luck, it'll blow a hole big enough for y'all to drop down. With any luck, Danny, do you even know what the fuck you're doing? Come on, it's dynamite. How complicated could it be? It's lit. Get the fuck away from the hole. No one really knows why Sal Marcano turned on Thomas Burke, uh, but he took Point Verdun from him and gave it to an enforcer named Roman the Butcher Barbieri, who promptly busted up one of Burke's legs. Now, Danny Burke was part of the heist crew. I mean, he was a gearhead, had never done anything like this before, but Thomas Burke insisted. He figured if the heist was a success, Sal would forgive him and return Point Verdun. Penetrator, all right. <laughs> hey, now I heard there ain't nothing sweeter than Vietnamese pussy. You tell me it's true. <laughs> Casanova Clay. Shit, man, it's so fucking good to see you. You too, Danny. That's Nikki. God, she wanted to be here, but I ain't remember how old. Ah, goddamn, you piece of shit. Yeah, unfortunately. Come on, let's grab a beer. Wait for the old man to chill out, and then we can get down to it. Yeah. What's up, man? 
You already got it all set up and organized. All the girls gonna be there and everything, except we just gotta go in my cars, because we can't roll up in that beat-up piece of shit outside. <laughs> oh, you didn't just call my all-American machine a beat I'm just saying, there better rides out there. Hey, bullshit there are. This car's a beast. I dropped the custom 358 in before we shipped out. That ain't the only thing you dropped in there. Maybe you should tell them about how you'd borrow it from Ellis and take the ladies <laughs> for a ride. Hell, man, leave me out of this. Wait, you fucking my car? Mm -hmm. nah, ain't no big deal. I was always wrapped up tight. <laughs> Besides, I already got one fucking bass in my life. I don't need another one. All right, you know what? You're going to clean it. Not just the back oh. seat. Every square inch. <laughs> I don't need to be riding around sitting in your shit. Hey, and you, funny man, you going to fucking help. Like the hell I am, shit, I didn't get any. Yeah, well, it was just new. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, you fucking jokers got about as much chance of pulling this off as I do at winning a goddamn decathlon. Oh, all right, Doc, we hear you. Donnie and Ellis, you're gonna use the drill to cut a hole up through the bottom of the vault. You and Georgie, you'll be inside. You're gonna drop the money down, then get the hell out of there. That goddamn drill ain't easy to move, though. So we need a boat, to get it through the canals and into position. Well, Ellis and I worry about the boat. See, George's old man flipped the guard at the reserve, giving you his truck. <laughs> <laughs> Between that and the uniforms, and no one gonna give us a second look. <laughs> Come on, let's get moving. Still gotta swing by Skeletters and finish up some prep work. Hey, you two assholes, don't think this gets you off the hook when it comes to my car. Y'all best get ready to clean it. I ain't cleaning shit. Hey, you cleaning it. My father was a lot of things, few of them good. But he started out smuggling moonshine, so he knew about the canals underneath the city, and that one of them went right under the Federal Reserve. It was his idea to use a boat to move the drill into position. He was a real son of a bitch, my father. More than anyone else, I blame him for what happened. You want to stick your own neck out? Fine. But leave your son out of it. It's his fault Danny died. Is everyone in? We need to go. We're all here. Go. Y'all see him? Right there. Guys, coming down through the hole. Fuck, four guys. We need to get the fuck out of here. Motherfuckers. Cops are cutting off our escape route. We'll find another way out of here. This tunnel has to go somewhere. Option is to head up. Are you kidding me? There'll be cops all over the place. Well, with any luck, they'll be too busy dealing with Mardi Gras. Notice us. Let's go. Well, damn it, this ain't a gas. Uh. Hey, you sure you need to grab that much of my ass? Oh, shut up and keep climbing, man. Come on, we got you. 
All right, once we get out there, I hit a payphone. Call soon to ride. Can you walk? Yeah, somebody give me a hand. I can get one. Uh, it's probably just gonna be easier to carry a sorry ass. Hold up. Come here. Hey, hey! Uh, don't put me the fuck down! If anybody asks, we say he's drunk. Y'all pick up that money. Let's go. Oh, God damn it. Look at the titties on her. Hey, darling, you looking for a good time? Danny, keep it down. No, actually, you get a look at the titties? I mean, God damn. Damn it, shut your mouth before you get us arrested. It's amazing. Stop, God damn it, stop! Fuck you, pig! Hey, man, get off the phone. Right fucking now. Oh, I will not be treated in such a manner. Y'all keep an eye out. We're in some deep shit and need your help. Where are you? Just off the parade route. Danny's hurt. Sammy's having a car delivered. It'll be at the loading dock at the grocery store. God bless the old man. Let's go. Sorry about that. Sir, are you okay? Hello? Hello! Thank you, Paul. Cocksucking cops tell me the party's over? I'll tell you when the goddamn party's over! An untold number of federal officers were killed today when two gunmen robbed the Federal Reserve. Fuck, you hear that? We made the news! Shut the fuck up, Georgia! We need to keep moving! I'm telling you for the last fucking time, you need to tell me what you did with the purse. Out of the way. Careful, you dumbass. Fuck, they found the boat. Stay cool, man. We're still good. That's not what she's saying. There's something wrong, boy. Lucky I don't leave your drunk ass in a ditch. I shouldn't have so much to drink. Stop moving around. Oh, sorry. What the fuck are we gonna do? Ellis. Fucking pigs are everywhere! Ellis, chill out. Everything's gonna be fine. All right, you guys, take Danny oh. and the money. Get to the car. I'll deal with the cops. I'll no. warn them off you. Hey, no fucking way, man. It's all right. He ain't going alone. We all got a friend. Jesus. Amen. All right, let's go. Officers engaging with suspect, respond with caution. 
Side of him, he said he'd meet us back at the house. Available Get in! Suspicious individual in vehicle. Officers investigating. Here they come! Lost. When we manage to get out of this, I'm sleeping on a bed of titties. I don't care what it fucking costs. They go? Yeah, yeah, man, they done. I knew we could pull it up. I knew it. We're rich. Fuck. <laughs> I'm robbing people with a six gun. I fought the law, and the law can kiss my ass. <laughs> <laughs> I fought the law and the law loss. <laughs> well, how much is it? A little over two million dollars <gasps> per split. <laughs> Holy mother of God. Once everything's settled up, I'm calling the man I know, having him bring over three hookers. Boy, ain't All no right. hooker ever stepping foot in this house. You sure? Cause two of them are for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be fucking in my new drifter. Well, I'd appreciate that. You know, my entire life, there's always been someone standing over me, telling me where I could go, what I could do, who I could be seen with. This. What you boys did tonight. This changes everything. This isn't just money. It's freedom. Real freedom. There ain't no one standing over me again. <laughs> over any of us. Vouloir <laughs> c'est pouvoir, eh? <laughs> well, well, well. Oh, man, man, look at this. Oh, and look at what I dug up. You mind pouring one more of those? Holy <laughs> shit. It'll be my pleasure. Judge, he told me ship went sideways during the robbery. Lincoln had to save your ass. You should be damn proud of that, boy. I am, Sal. More than you'll ever know. <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ, that is some down-home hooch right there, isn't it? <laughs> All right. Listen, I got a guy outside. Y'all mind if he comes in and packs up my cut? Not at all. 
Look at that. Let's see if you can handle this down on move. Yeah, why don't you give me some of that? Trying to get some corn whiskey, make you a man. <laughs> they all the same. <laughs> hey, take the one on the end. It's your cut, plus what I owe you. Even put in a little extra for your trouble. Couldn't have pulled it off without you, Sammy. You all done right by me tonight. Mwah. Mwah. Why don't you get us something off the top shelf? We need to celebrate. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you ain't got to tell me, yeah. twice. When I was pulling Lincoln out of the fire, he woke up long enough to tell me to call John Donovan. So that's what I did. Most days I wish I'd never made that call. Mr. Donovan, do you know this individual? Sure. Sal Marcano. Mm -hmm. And how about this man? That's Sal's worthless piece of shit, brother Lou. Look. Enough of the dog and pony bullshit. What's your real question? Did you help Lincoln Clay murder Sal Marcano and all prominent members of his crime family? You're goddamn right I did. So those the men you're gonna kill, huh? That's the plan, Padre. It's a dangerous course you're contemplating. And what do you think we should do? Sal Marcano deserves to die. I won't argue otherwise. Kill him. But let that be the end of it. That's not enough! It's enough if you say it's enough. I know what Sal did to you, Lincoln. But nothing you do will bring any of them back. This isn't about bringing them back. Or even exacting some street justice. It's about making that bastard feel what it's like to lose everything. Watch as I take it all away from him. one-way road, Lincoln. And once you start down it, there ain't no turning back. I'm going to Sammy's to get my stuff. You 
ready. I'll be waiting in the car. Taught us kids to turn the other cheek, not fight back. Problem is, that don't work. Not in the real world. 